Stay tuned to this video. In the next few minutes, David from Tame Work Holden is going to teach me and you how to get more from your three axis machine. David, welcome. Thanks, Joe. Take a start. Let's take this as the machine bed, whether it's drilled or slotted, however you've got it, with a very simple zero point plate, we can produce a five axis component. What, what I'll do for clarity here is I'll use this plate. So we'll assume this is the table, this is your small plate. It saves everything moving around. So we can currently machine round the top. That's about what we can do on our three axis and we can drill. If we use our multi-rise, we can come on the side, we can profile the side, we can do whatever we feel like in four axes, but only four axes. The other thing that we can do with our multi-rise is rise it. So where you've got very small components and you're using long tools, we can bring it up so the tools can be yep, good much idea. shorter, stronger, better finish. So that's the multi-rise. Let's create this on your three axis machine. We have our multi-rad and it's a rotating device, but it rotates through 90 degrees. So almost like an indexing head of, of old. It is like an indexer. It can be accurate to 0.1 of a degree and with our inclinometer block, we can set the angle. So we'll come to this later, but we can set if we're drilling a hole in the side, obviously I'm gonna do this up, but we can come in at the angle that we've set to. So for compound angles, I haven't got a five axis machine, you don't wanna make a fixture. Here you are. So, and then, so for the next 90 degrees, you, can, you just spin it around. Right? Very good. To create your five axis component. Okay, yeah, so manual five axis. Manual five axis effectively. You can make two of these to a double compound, but mm -hmm. it starts getting complicated. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can see this. It, it's great for a first time user. Clearly, if you're making volume at that, it's probably not the, the solution, but- Certainly not. That's, no. that's a five axis simultaneous job. Yeah, so, but for compound angles, for doing complex parts, maybe you're a first time user, you've got a three axis machine, perfect. Or a prototype, anything. Yeah, so with one, two, three items, you can produce this item. And presumably, tame work holder, they're not, they, they don't cost the world either. Of course not, Joe. <laughs> Very cost-effective solution. There we are, so how do people find out more? Maybe they've got, it's not limited, dare I say it, you could do it on a turret mill. Probably not that, but you know, you could you get You can do it on a turret stuff. mill. You could do it on a manual mill, mm -hmm. if you're very good at winding a handle. Sure. But no, very simple free axis machine. You can create some very complicated five axis parts. Fantastic. How do people find out more about these new products? Come and look on the website. We'll be out there, there very we soon. There we are. So if you want to get more from your three axis machine, maybe even make something like this, believe it or not. Get in touch with Tame Work Holding. Thank you.